8 plus 2 under square root 15 under square root. So we have to simplify it. Let's try. We can write 8 as 5 plus 3 plus 2 and square root of 15 as 5 times 3 under square root. Again, if a times b is under square root then we can write it as square root of a times square root of b. Also square root of a square is equal to a because we can then cancel out this square root and this square. So we can write 5 as square root of 5 square 3 as square root of 3 square because you can remove the square root and it will be 5 and 3 plus 2 times square root of 5 times square root of 3 under square root. Now if a is equal to square root of 5 and b is equal to square root of 3 then this is in the form of a square plus b square plus 2ab and this is an algebraic expression we can write it as a plus b whole square. So this will be square root of 5 plus square root of 3 whole square under square root. Now we can remove this square root with the square so answer will be square root of 5 plus square root of 3. You can further simplify it by putting the value of square root of 5 or square root of 3 or you can leave it here. Like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.